followed you. They said yes to you. They want to see what you guys are having to share. But every time you guys share an update, you do a post on your Facebook, you send an email blast out to all of your subscribers, at best, only two of them are going to see that update. Most of the time it's one or even less than that. Only two are going to see that update. The other eight didn't even see it. Now, why is that a problem? Well, let me show you here on top of just being the obvious. National Sales Executive Association showed that 80% of sales are made between the fifth and the 12th contact. You have to reach your prospects up to a dozen times with your value for them to say, hmm, I might be interested in buying that product or service they're offering. Only 2% of sales guys are made on the first contact. And most of you guys are only looking for that first contact. And if they're interested, great. If they're not, all right, move on to the next one. Many. Okay, you're not gonna go and text people one by one all the time, even though it does work. A lot of people, how many people received a text message from me to get invited here? A few people, good. All right, so social media email's working as well. But I did get, uh, uh, about, what was it? A week and a half, two weeks ago, I looked at the registrations, and I'm like, oh, no, 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 we need to fill this up. So I just started texting a bunch of people, and half of them replied, about half of them signed up, so pretty good stuff. But you wanna do, one to many. This is called SMS broadcasting, okay? Now, by doing SMS broadcasting, there's three downsides that I've discovered. One is the triple opt-in. Most of you guys have not even heard of this. The triple opt-in goes like this. If you want to send somebody a text message to their phone and you're marketing them, especially one to many, you have to do on some states what's called a triple opt-in. One is you gotta get their cell phone number. You gotta get them to actually give you that 10-digit number. It's not easy. Okay? Most marketers are going to tell you, do not ask for a phone number if you're marketing online. You'll get like a tenth of the submissions. People don't want to give their cell. And he is not getting hired for speaking engagements. He's like, man, I, I, I need help getting out there. People think I'm on my deathbed and I just finished a battle with cancer and I need to get out into the speaking world again. Again, I have 500,000 fans on Facebook. We want to get to a million and I need to just be traveling the world speaking again. I was like, all right, let's put together an app that does one motivates people. You're a motivational speaker. Let's take all of your favorite speeches, put some background music to it, splice them up, and now you open up the app and it starts talking. Radio Latino Inc. listeners, this is Manny Lopez. I just finished an awesome presentation in Carlsbad. Had the whole media team out here. Everybody was just having so much fun. We were learning about automation marketing. How to generate leads in your sleep. Did you know that you're wasting 80 to 95% of your efforts if you promote your offers via email or social media? I'm changing the way we do it because we market through mobile apps and I'm doing it in a way that gives back, okay? I'm an orphan. I was orphaned at 18 months. I was adopted and returned seven different times. I found a mentor though, a mentor that showed me how to be too blessed to be stressed. And that's what I want to show the world. I'm going to show it through orphans. Every time we bring on a new business that helps us, that grows our business and we help them grow their business, we get to bless an orphan or a child in foster care with their own business. So if you want to learn how to do it, go to my website. It's from orphan to CEO.com. Or you can go to hellomanny.com. Those are the same site. So I'd love to see you guys chat with me, connect with me, and I would love to see you guys on the next video. And always remember, you are too blessed to be stressed.